Hey guys, welcome back to part 6 of my Silent Hill playthrough. If you're just joining us, make sure you watch this from the beginning, go back to part 1 and watch it through. We are just going to go ahead and get started, and don't forget to like and subscribe, greatly appreciated. Alright, so, when we left off last time, we were talking about going back up to the third floor, which is probably not going to be the third floor because we are nowhere right now. So we're going to hit the elevator and go to the third floor. A letter doesn't appear to be working. Hmm. Okay. It's going to take a minute to get my bearings. Hmm. Don't have a map. It's going to be tough to remember where I have been and haven't been. Okay. Yeah, I remember being here. Pretty sure. The bird cage is locked. Okay, do we have a key? Yeah, just full disclosure, I haven't played this game in like a week. <laughs> uh, I was, I got a little behind on some things. I was actually going back and, you know, I, I, I watched this through when I was editing it. So I remember what I was doing there or editing, you know, for the last video. Um, but it might take me just a little bit of readjusting remember where I was. Okay, so I don't have a key for this. Hmm. Doesn't tell me anything about it. Bird cage is locked. Okay, that's all it says. So just a key, no engravings or anything. There's some ammo here. Oh, shit. Wasn't expecting that. Man, they keep grabbing me. Oh, oh damn. Alright, not doing a whole lot of damage. Oh. There we go. I finally could get a swing and he's so slow. Ah, come on. Yeah, at first I was confused. I was like... Why can't he swing? And I realized she was grabbing me. And every time one of the other ones let go, somebody else would grab me, so. That was a little. Alright. Uh, map. Check my health. Yeah, I might as well take a little Tylenol. There we go. Good as new. Is there just nothing in here? Oh, that's where I got the key from. How did they get in here? I've already been in here and got what I needed. I should have just turned around and walked out the door. Alright. Locked. The word. Salage. Hmm. I know I've been in here. I remember this takes me to, I think, what the third floor was supposed to be. I think. Man, I really wish I had a map. Oh yeah, the key that's electrified. <coughs> Excuse me. I'll get a shock if I grab it now. Hmm. Now, wasn't there one of those doors that actually took me down to the basement? Can I go turn off the generator in the basement? Yeah, I think one of these doors kind of took me down to the basement. Unless I'm tripping, man. I might be totally off. Yeah, here we go. I don't remember. I, th I feel like most of the doors were sealed up down here to where I couldn't get into them, though. So, Nah, that's what it was. That's right. Yeah, it's all messed up. At the 
desk with all kinds of stuff written on it. Hmm. This is crazy. Okay, here's where the elevator was. Now, let's see what we got. like I saw something in the door as it was opening. Okay, this is different. Yeah, I definitely haven't been here. Oh, it's that altar. That was in that uh, antique shop. I don't know if it's the same one, but I'm going to try and put that drug in here. It's probably not the thing I'm supposed to do. Nah, okay. What else do I have? Can't use the camera here. Hmm. Okay. Let's see what we got. It looks like there might be a puzzle on the doors. Oh, damn. Hmm. Damn. I don't know. Give you nothing on here. All right. Gonna push the middle and see what happens. Hmm. Yeah, I need something for that. Wonder what they worship. Can I look at any of these pictures? Oh, cool, I can. The light to the future. The light to the future. The light illuminating the darkness. Okay. The light to the future and the light illuminating the darkness. Okay. Something to do with light. And I didn't get like a lighter or anything. Did I get a lighter? Let me look through my stuff again. Got my flashlights already on. Yeah, I was thinking, I had a lighter from when I was in the... Uh, Man, was it in the hospital before? When I had to burn through that stuff with the alcohol? Hmm. 7-3. Hmm. Man, I feel like I'm missing something here. The light to the future. Light to the future. Light illuminating the darkness. Anything else in here? Hmm. Try to see if there are like any markers on there or anything that might indicate which buttons I have to push on that door. But I, I mean, there's got to be something I have to do with this altar here. But maybe it reveals something. Wonder what they worship. Hmm. All right, I'm a little stuck on this. I'm going to have to let this kind of sink in for a while before I know what to do. I forgot, I forgot what's going on up here. Okay, yeah, that's the jewelry store. Yeah, sorry, I know we came this way, but I'm just trying to get my bearings. Did I go in that little room over here? Nope. 
All right, so it's going to be this room that kind of takes me to the portal hallway or whatever you want to call it, the hallway that kind of seems to be the center of things. And is this what has the plate on the wall? The electrified key? Yeah. Okay, so that's what's important. I need to figure out how to get a key off the wall, and I need to figure out what to do with that altar. So, I'm going to explore around... Oh, and that birdcage. Yeah. Explore around and see if I missed anything. Alright, yeah, so this is where Lisa was. Did I miss anything in here? I know she had her book in the middle of the floor. Hmm, did I overlook anything? You know, I don't think I tried to take a picture of those, um, those two framed pictures by the altar. Maybe that's something. I want to explore around here a little bit and see what I can find first. That. Nothing. Okay, I brought it back out. Okay, I saw this. Let me read this again, see if it has anything. I think this just kind of informed the other thing when I had to figure out the uh, how to open that door. Yeah, Grim Leap Reaper's list, head count. Yeah, I don't think I think I got that already. Hmm. Elevator. Basement to the classroom. I'm gonna check out the classroom. I can't remember if I got anything from there before, and it seems like there would have to be something in there. I'm just gonna check again. Looks like it says the same stuff. Okay, yeah, that's right. I got the... Okay, that's right. Yeah, I got that from there. Just gonna take a walk around. Kind of wondering if I do have the tools to, you know, pass a few objectives here. And I'm just really overlooking something. Just making sure that was where the bird cage was. Um, you know, for the heck of it, I'm gonna see if I can use any of these things here. And I think I already tried. Camera with flash. It, it's hinting at that flash. I'm gonna go up and see if I can uh, take a picture of those pictures with the camera. It, I mean, it's kind of hitting at me that flash, and then it's talking about the light illuminating the darkness, light for the future. You know. So let's go see. I hope it's something, because otherwise I'm <laughs> I'm kind of stumped. I just hope they give you some good hints, because even if I get past that, I don't know how uh, 
how tough the, the riddles are going to be to get these doors open here. Come on, give me something. Oh, yes. All right, cool. Okay. I'm kind of thinking that's... <sighs> hmm. That's kind of a tough one. I don't know. I'm wondering if it's going to be, you know, the buttons for each of the intersections. I'm thinking, you know, each it obviously has three different, you know, shapes here. So I'm, I'm thinking this is going to be the code for the top, you know, and the bottom two. So, hmm. So I kind of have some ideas I'm going to try out. So top left, bottom right, then arrow. And yeah, I don't know if I'm supposed to fill in all of them or if I'm just going to do like kind of like I said where they, they kind of intersect. The top left, the top left, bottom right. And then kind of arrow down here. Ah oh, man, I think I'm off. Maybe you know I probably got to draw the shape completely. That's probably what it is. I think this was the shape. Might have the arrow in the wrong direction. Nope. All right, sweet. All right, so that door should be open, I think. I'll go ahead and solve this puzzle first. All right. I'm an upside down U cross lower left triangle. Yeah, is that not it? Oh, lower left triangle, okay. Awesome, okay. That honestly wasn't nearly as hard as I thought it was going to be. Is this the director's office? Perennial herb found near water reaches a height of 10 to 15 inches, oblong leaves, white blossoms. Seeds contain a hallucinogen. Ancient records show it was used for religious ceremonies. The hallucinogenic effect was key. Hmm. I wonder if I'm about to get high on this plant. <laughs> Maybe they'll let me in that door that's still locked downstairs. I mean, finding his daughter in the nightmarish other world, might as well go get high. Perfect idea. What, is that all in here? Yeah, I thought this was something on the floor over here. Just kind of walking on it. Guess not, I guess that's nothing. I'm going to go read this again just to make sure I understand. White Claudia, 10 to 15 inches, oblong leaves. Found near water. Okay, religious. Religious. I'm, I'm glad I caught that again. Religious ceremony. Okay. I probably need to take that back to the altar. birdcage key awesome okay now i wonder if that key inside the birdcage is going to be the the key to that final door that's downstairs 
I want the failage or whatever that says on there. Hmm. All right, we got something to work with. Can we go back down to the first one? Yeah, okay. First floor. I don't remember. Okay, yeah. So birdcage key should be over here. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Anything else in there? Nope. All right, brace yourself. Oh, it's a whole bunch of new stuff over here. Oh, damn. I was not expecting that. Wow, that was pretty cool. Like one of those little munchkins from earlier in the game. B Thor. Oh, wow. We still got. Okay. We still got some stuff to figure out. Oh, the kitchen. Okay. Kind of different. What's that stuck in there? The chain is missing a link. Dagger of Melchior. Yes, I'll take it. The chain is missing a link. Okay, I don't have any chain links around, do I? I don't know why, but the layout, like going back behind there is just kind of creeping me out. Oh, damn. Okay. Oh, get up. Come on. Don't die. What the hell? Yo, I was not expecting that. So, don't take out the dagger? Okay, I need to find... Oh, damn, I didn't save. I gotta go through all that again. Alright, so I gotta find a chain link. Okay. Get spoiled on new games with auto saving. But it should be pretty easy. I don't think I really lost very much. I mean, I was kind of mostly just looking around the entire time what the hell you see that yo that was like his daughter right there I don't know if that happened last time man but I didn't catch it that was what okay all right Man, I was not expecting that thing. I mean, when that thing came out, I mean, obviously it took me by complete surprise, but I mean, I was not expecting it to kill me, though. I was actually kind of expecting, like, all right, maybe it's going to take me to, like, some other dimension or other part of this, and it's just, you know, part of the storyline. Was totally not expecting that to happen. I mean, yeah, it's, it's probably expected that most people are going to get killed <laughs> on the first go around there. Okay, so...
And if you guys are liking the content, please like and subscribe. I'd greatly appreciate it. Okay, that was it for in here. Just that book. Okay. So now birdcage and save. Alright, now, unless I'm just really misremembering something, I think we're as, as far as we got before. So we should be good, and I just need to save more often. <coughs> I'm overwrite this one. And be ready for that little invisible guy. <laughs> okay, I think this door was. This. Yeah. Okay. Ah, man, I'm kind of torn. Should I? Should I just leave? Because I'm assuming that it's the dagger holding it in there, but I don't know. Because didn't it come out of the bottom? I mean, uh, no, I mean, I'm just going to leave that. Run, get away. All right, so I think I'm good as long as I don't take that out. All right. I was eyeballing this before. Nope, nothing in there. Bethor. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. An Ankh. Bottle filled with some kind of drug. Better leave it. Here's a pornography magazine. Oh, jelly beans. Okay, yeah. Let's take time to open up some jelly beans. Come on. Oh, the key in there. All right, cool. Oh, let's play that tape in the VCR. Think it's going to be something different this time, or it's actually going to work? Hmm. Still has an unusually high fever. Eyes don't open. Getting a pulse, but just barely breathing. 
skin is all charred. Even when I change the bandages, the blood and pus just start oozing through. Why? What is keeping that child alive? I can't stand it any longer. I won't tell a soul. Promise. Oh, please. Hmm. Okay. Did it eat my tape? Okay, I can watch it again if I wanted to. That's interesting. I wonder what they're talking about there. What child? Kind of expected it to give me something. Okay. Pretty sure I've been in here, just kind of getting, yeah, just kind of getting mixed up on where I've been and which way I came from. Did I come from this way? Is this the B Thor, I think? Okay. Aratron. Wait, didn't I have a card for some reason or another? Specimens of butterflies and moths hanging on the wall. Okay, wonder if there's a reason for noting that. Child's drawings. Oh, is that his daughter's dress? Thou possess them to guard thy spirit. Evoke five rites, unveil thy fate. I'm going to try and put that onk there. Or maybe this. Uh, okay, so it's going to be those, like, religious pieces I've been picking up everywhere. Okay, he's the onk. That ring is probably something. Okay, that's something. Crest of Mercury. Ah, uh, I really thought that ring was something. The Ring of Contract. So I'm still short a few. Okay. I really thought that key was something. Or that uh, ring, I mean. Music getting a little bit creepier now that I'm getting some stuff on that door, though. Okay, go back to that door of uh, B Thor that I have the key to over here. The generator. All right. So, this will probably let me turn stuff off so I can access that electrified key. I wonder if that electrified key is going to be a key to Aratron. wonder if shit's about to hit the fan with the power off. Which one was it? Was it you? Oh, where are you at? I just took a blind swing just in case. Oh!
Man, that is unsettling. Okay. Key of, yep, key of Eritron, okay. I'm getting close. Everything is going according to plan, sheltered in the womb. Dr. Coffin? It's not done yet. Panthazol is lost. That's <laughs> why the seed lies dormant. And what soul remains captured in that husk is buried deep down in the subconscious. Are you trying to say it won't work? That wasn't our agreement. No, no, these are just stalling tactics. If we lend a hand, we will be able to get power. Never fear. The promise shall not be broken. But the power we could grow now will be very weak. Almost nothing. Unless we get the other half of the soul. We'll use a magical spell. Feeling this child's pain, it's sure to come. But that will take time. What the heck? Oh yeah, this is Alyssa's room. Okay, I wonder if that's another one of those religious symbols that I need. Wow, okay. One more, and it looks like a giant cross I'm going to need. Hmm. Man, did I just flat out miss it somewhere, guys? So I need a chain link, or do I have something that I can use as a chain link to seal that up to get that dagger out? I wonder if that dagger is actually the last piece. I just need to do some experimenting.
Hmm. Huh. Chain is missing a link. That ring. Yes, okay. Try and get me. I still just bust ahead of there. All right, cool. All right, well, hopefully this dagger is the last piece that I need. Yeah, it could be a dagger. I was thinking it was a cross, but yep, perfect. Perfect, sweet. Mommy tells you now. I just want you to lend me a teeny bit of your power. That's all. No. I don't want to do it. It will make everyone happy, and it's for your own good, too. Oh, but Mommy, I just want to be with you. Just two of us. Please understand. Oh, yes, I see. Maybe Mommy has been wrong. Mommy! Why didn't I see this before? There's no reason to wait. Herein lies the mother's womb, containing the power to create life. I would have done it all myself. Mommy? What the hell was that about? <laughs> I feel like I'm in Resident Evil right now. Alright, we are somewhere totally new. Are we approaching the end? Long ass flight of steps. Yeah, this is getting pretty good. It feels like you know all these stories are kind of coming together, so Oh yeah. Well, well, well. To think you'd make it this far. Where's Cheryl? What have you done to her? What are you talking about? You've seen her many times. No mood for jokes. Don't you see? She's right there. That's absurd. You are the only one who thinks so. Why? Why are you doing this? It's been a long seven years. For the seven years since that terrible day, Alessa has been kept alive, suffering a fate worse than death. Alessa has been trapped in an endless nightmare from which she never awakens. He has been nurtured by that nightmare, waiting for the day to be born. That day has finally come. The time is now. Everyone will be released from pain and suffering. 
Our salvation is at hand. This is the day of reckoning. When all our sorrows will be washed away. When we return to the true paradise. My daughter will be the mother of God. Well, goddamn. What the hell? go the Harry blaster oh dr. Kaufman what return things to how they were before Kaufman did I ask for this nobody uses me hey still got some of them drugs Kaufman <laughs> Been in the air for a pretty long time. <laughs> oh shit oh man you done messed up Kaufman oh damn so uh you fighting with me bro damn need to get a better weapon all right shoot man I'm not very well armed I'm gonna start out with the handgun just to see you know what kind of shots I get on them that way I'm not practicing with my high-powered ammo let's see if that pays off Damn, okay, alright. Sorry, man. Oof. I mean, Kaufman's want to throw this stuff at you, though. I, I, I ain't do nothing. Yeah, I can't, I can't even see him. I don't know when I'm supposed to shoot at him. Okay, so he does that. I wonder if now... Alright. So I'm thinking whenever he's done that, he's... Ah, oh, man. Alright, he got me. So I think I gotta wait until he does that and then start shooting at him.
Uh, we're skipping that. Alright, so I'm going to start out with my handgun again. Just to make sure I'm getting these shots on them and I got the, the rhythm down right. And once I know I'm getting clean shots on them, I'm going to go the opposite direction. I'm going to hit him with the rifle. Then when I run out of the rifle, I'm going to hit him with the shoddy. Damn, he's got good aim. I thought I, thought I could outrun it. But, man, that does not seem to be the case. I hope it doesn't take crazy long to kill him because... Hmm. I don't have that much health. Be able to get myself back to full health like four more times. Alright. Stop procrastinating. Ah, oh, I didn't bring up my damn, I didn't bring out my gun. I wonder if it is possible to run away from that or if it's just like ooh, alright, alright, alright. All right. Ah, God damn. Alright, we didn't take away all my health that time, though. So, yeah, I'm going to take out my rifle. A oh, no! Are you serious? Oh, it's not aiming at him. Oh, that was disappointing as hell. Damn, that was disappointing. <laughs> I wonder why it's not aiming at him. All right, I gotta get closer, I guess. All right, well that takes care of that. Damn, I broke. Man, I wasted like two or three shots. All right, so I know I can hit him farther away with the handgun. So all I got left is handgun ammo now. I wonder if I can use this now. Alright. Got quite a bit of hand handgun ammo, so it might be a grind, but I'm not going through I mean it's been okay as far as him hitting me, like maybe 50-50. And it's not been that bad, so maybe I can just kinda of grind it out with the handgun. Damn. I don't think I hit my... Didn't get health in time. Alright, well now at least I know I gotta get closer to hit him with the rifle, so... At least that'll give me a couple more shots in on him. Yeah, so disappointing. Aiming that rifle and just firing it off into nothing. <laughs> Alright, so health is good. Get my rifle. Reload my rifle. If I run more sporadically. Damn. Alright. Right off the bat. Got me pretty good. Alright. All right, hit him with all my shots right off the bat. Damn. Oof. He hit me with everything he had that time.
I mean, does it have anything to do with this? Damn. Does it have anything to do with this gate right here? All right, let's give it to it, man. Maybe this will be the last time. <laughs> I gotta figure out how to run to get away from those strikes. Those lightning strikes are just crazy powerful. Dahlia. Oops. Man, I wish I had more than six shots with this rifle. Ooh, uh. ah. All right, got around at that time. Ah, that was gonna get away from it again. Let's take some medicine. Eh, am I out of ammo? No, good, all right. Now I am. Shit. Ah. Once again, I thought I got away with it, but no dice. But at least I'm only getting partially struck, though. That's key. Only handgun ammo, man. I know it's gonna be a grind. All right, <laughs> I was I knew I was taking a chance there, going so long against it, but ooh.
He's been laying around the whole time. Lazy prick. Uh oh. <laughs> Come with me, doctor. I was going to fight her too. Say, like, can I please just run? I have no ammo left. Just let me be. Music is actually pretty tight. Well, give me uh, cinematics following this up. Man, what a cool game! <laughs> that was a lot of fun. A lot of, a lot of really tough parts, though. I'm actually really surprised. I thought it was gonna take me a few more times than that last one. I, honestly, I mean, when I when I first did when I did the first one. Now, quickly I died. I was like, "Oh man, this is gonna be a, this is gonna be a grind." Actually, surprised I was able to kill it with a handgun at all. Just thinking back to uh, how much trouble I had to that that monster previously in the school. And that's awesome. I, I think I am going to follow this up with a with a Silent Hill review just to kind of give an overall thought on the game. Um, yeah, and just, you know, my thoughts, give it a review, kind of give it a rating. Um, if you enjoyed it, please give me a like, subscribe, and check out more of my content. Um, whenever I, I should be releasing that review pretty soon, so make sure you hit the bell icon to get notifications so you can see that when it comes out. And if there are any other games you guys want me to do, make sure to leave that in the comments. You know, drop it down there, and I'll look. And if you know something gets, you know, if, so, if something I'm interested in or something seems to get, um, you know, a lot of interest, I'll definitely check it out. Is that going to be everything? No cinematics at the end? I'm going to check out the menu if you guys want to hang around. Oh, wait, here we go. They try to give everybody some uh, some character. So I'm a little bit confused about Cheryl. I mean, did she straight up kill Cheryl and she was reborn? I mean, that seems to be the only way that could have happened.
<laughs> yeah, after this is over, you guys want to stick around? I'm going to look at the menu to see if it gives me any other options for when I restart, like any new difficulty ratings, like um, cheat codes, anything like that. <laughs> It's kind of interesting that they did that. Kind of humanized everyone. Wonder whose idea that was. Okay, so normal mode, game clears, my first playthrough. Had the good ending, apparently, so there were multiple endings. 44 saves, 8 continues. Total time, 7.5 hours. Walking distance, uh, almost 8 kilometers. Running distance, 24 kilometers. Weird they don't add those together. So ran for over 30 kilometers, or, you know, traveled. 177 out of 204 items. So does that mean I just straight up missed that many items? Wow. 27 items? Damn, okay. I uh, killed 117 enemies by shooting, 50 by, or fighting. Uh, 50 by shooting, shooting style, short range, mid range. Interesting. Got a pretty awful ranking, didn't I? <laughs> Is that 4 out of 8 possible? Okay. Yeah, it was a little shaky pretty early on. I didn't think I did too bad, though. I wonder what it ranks you on, like your fighting style? Because it really, it really should rank you... I feel like I did really well on the puzzles. I was actually surprised I didn't get too tripped up. Um, you know, that one really threw me in the... You know, like the, the horoscope puzzle or whatever. That one kind of threw me for a bit. I kind of threw a Hail Mary and, and got through it. But I honestly almost kind of panicked a little bit. I was like, I don't know what to do here. <laughs> but uh, got through it. And that was that. But uh, is it okay to save? Yes. Next beer. Oh, that's for a new one. I should create a new file. Okay. Is it going to start me right off? Because I didn't want to do that. Skip that. Um, load continue. Yeah, let's see if it gives me anything. Maybe not. Okay. Yeah, so it looks like it's not. Yeah, it didn't give me any more difficulties. Oh, damn. I didn't mean to continue. Anyway. I really glad I'm really appreciate you guys, you know, for watching me and sticking through me, uh, sticking with me through these um, six videos to play through to the end. It's been really fun. Hope you guys enjoyed it too. Um, again, if you like the content, like and subscribe, hit that bell icon so you get notifications when I release a new video, and I'll see you next time.